You got 48 hours to build, sand, and paint a dining room table. Why you started it? I gotta get an inspection first. I just left from getting an inspection. Well, not getting an inspection, trying to get an inspection, but they say that they inspect the night in today, so I gotta go somewhere else to get an inspection. I came to get another inspection. They machine not working. Oh, I don't wanna go to one of them big places and have to wait. The spot right behind me, they said it's gonna take a few hours because they gotta take the car to a whole nother shop to do the inspection. I'ma just find me a Jiffy Lube and go there. I just left out of Home Depot to check to see if they had a two by six boards, two by six by eight boards. They don't have it here, they got the more expensive ones. It's one over in Tomball that they got some, and there's $3.12. Here they $4.07. I need 11 boards. So if I get 11 of the $3.12, after taxes, it'd be like $34. Then if I get the boards that's $4.07, before taxes, they're gonna be like $44 and some change. So the one in Tomball, they only have four of them. So I may have to get those four and then the rest of them inside the four dollar boards. But that'll still be cheaper. But should I just go and get these boards since I'm here? <laughs> Do you waste the gas going over there? I don't see the four boards. It's like I'm gonna have to get all <laughs> 11 of the um, 407 ones. So these right here. So I could have just got these at our house. I mean, by our house. The only good thing, these boards do look better than the ones over there though. I can't say that. I want to get all the best looking ones. I want the light color look. So the lightest boards I'm gonna use as a tabletop. The darker boards I'm gonna use as the framing and the bottom to paint. So we're about to get the boards cut. They um, went up on the prices too, because he said the first two cuts is free, then each cut after that is a dollar. Alright, thank you. We finished. Alright, so this is all the stuff I got so far. I'm pretty much done. I just need to paint to paint the leads black in one of the boards black and then i need a finisher so i can coat it so it can be finished i probably spent about a good hour in that stove but that wasn't the hardest part the hardest part is <laughs> if all this go fit in this car i hope so My mama Sita just made me some chicken minis. I just had my lunch, well breakfast. <laughs> that's my first time eating today. I gotta rip all these boards. These boards are two by six by eight and I need to rip them and get them down to two by five by eight. So I'm gonna take a half an inch. Those are rounded and I want them to be square. So I'm gonna take a half an inch off. So take a quarter off each side to get them down to five. Last one.
one, baby. Last one. The battery went dead. They don't want me to prosper. They don't want me to prosper. But we're gonna prosper anyway. I'm almost done, baby. I'm out here in the 100 degree weather. That's why I'm sweating so much. In the 100 degree weather, putting them together. All I got to do once I finish this, sweep all this trash, all the dust, and put it in the box, go dump that, put it together, sand it, paint it, drill it together, and I'm done. I wish we had a leaf blower, so once I finish, I can get all the rest of the dust up out of there. Because I know it's going to be some hot in places. I wish I could just blow it. The yard people out here doing the grass say if I was finished, I probably would have asked them, can they come in here and just blow it? But they let me use it and not blow it. But I'm almost done. I'm going to finish this today. This getting done today. We're going to be eating our dinner on this tonight. Watch what I tell you. Y'all, my honey needed Mrs. Fix-It to come out here to assist with his work on the table. So I came out here, I'm just gonna show y'all what he doing right now. So it's coming along. The table coming along, he putting the parts together. I think I'm gonna take this one up. Why? Use that long screw. Huh, that's the <laughs> <laughs> She said that's more work. Uh -huh. Tonight gonna be the first night we use this table on um, Friday pizza night. Y'all, we gotta watch three hours of our movies today because last week your girl was tired. So y'all know the Marvel movies is always like two hours or something long. So last week I was tired. I couldn't last past the hour. I was dozing, out, dozing off. They caught me dozing off. So I'm like, man, we could just, you know, watch this, catch back up next time. We were supposed to watch it Sunday, but we didn't. So we got to watch three hours worth tonight. I wonder if I can last three hours. But I have been lasting all the other weeks. I haven't, I dozed off a couple times the other weeks, but I haven't been like so tired that I couldn't finish it. But they've been real good, y'all. If y'all ain't seen all the marbles in order, go back and watch all the marbles in order. I know. You know, y'all probably watch, say, Spider-Man, Superman, not Superman, Spider-Man, he and Black Panther. 
Vodka, but wash them in order. They are really, 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 really good. You just a dripping sweat. Are we gonna be able to carry this ourselves? I'm gonna. Uh, I got it. <laughs> I'm gonna just do this, spray it down and stuff, then put that together, spray it down and stuff. And I'm gonna take this up by myself, then that up. I'm talking about is this gonna be able to maneuver through them curves? Yeah, because all we gotta do is take it up there and say, once we get to the stairs, put this first and turn it like that. Ooh. You still eating? It's hot. Mm. Yeah, it is. I just spray painted outside the base what I'm gonna have all black and I'm about to put together the tabletop right now. So that's the tabletop. I'm gonna show y'all the outside. Finally finished this table. Whoop my behind. I'm tired. But this is what I want to do to the tabletop. I don't want no ordinary table. Y'all know I like to be different. So what I did, I took two people different plans and I made my own plan. And I made a dining table. We not finished. What we're about to do is put our handprints on the table to give it our family character but look at this table this thing is nice this look like it belongs in one of those custom houses yeah great. how y'all like the table great great you like it dilly 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 I never seen nobody make a table like this. They made it like with the black on the bottom and that kind of top, but I added my own little character by putting a black line this way. This was my mama seat the idea. This gonna be hard because he love to ball his head up. Ow, 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 ow. That's oh. good. That's good. Now so, Alright. This how y'all gonna go. Grab it, I'm gonna put it on the can out, palm out, and go straight on it and hold it, count to five. And then Come when y'all pull it up, don't pull it back. Pull it straight up so you don't mess it up. Screw that. And when y'all go wash our hands, do not touch nothing. I'm not gonna do it. Yeah. Go straight to the sink and wash. Go. Yeah, that's good. Come on. Open everything with the other hand, yeah. Go. Push all your... All right, come straight up. Yeah, all right. Put it all right here. Any, no, it can go anywhere you desire. If you wanted it right there, you could have. It just anywhere. I 
So this is the finished product of the table. These are our hand prints. Dylan, Davion, Dominique. My hand print, and then my mama Seekers. This is the finished product of the table. It has some nice character to it. I love the color of this table. This is the table. And y'all see the detail in the table with the wood marks. We put a coat on here. We finished it with a clear coat on top of it. We did that the end of the night after we built the table, but it's not as thick and as much on there that I would like. So when we do move into our spot, because this table is not, the boards are not the same exact height. Some boards are higher than the other ones. So when we do move into our permanent home or when we move to our next home, I am going to take the tabletop and get the whole tabletop sanded down to the same exact height. Once they the same exact height, it'll um, look way better, even though it look amazing already, but it will look a hundred times better, well, 10 times better than what it does now. So we may have to redo our fingerprints because that may get sanded down. So everything is perfect. Everything is good. I much rather this table than the one that I did before because this one is not going to be like a crumb catcher and put crumbs and stuff in the cracks. Damn, look like that was long enough. Y'all see how that's good? You can. So we gonna be good to go. The table, we love it. I love it. My mama Sita love it. The kids love it. And now we got a place for the family to gather around. And then we still have enough space in the kitchen. We got all this space in the kitchen right there. Right here, we got a lot of space. And right there, we have a lot of space. We decided to go with a big table. This table is pretty, probably too big for this kitchen, but we don't plan on being here forever. But I was gonna wait until we moved to build this table, but I just decided to do it now because I'm on a journey to do new stuff, new and improved stuff. So I just want to make the table now and then just improve it once we do move. But there you have it, there go the table, we all enjoyed it. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. We'll see y'all tomorrow. Peace.